Hello there and welcome to the new Google Data Studio tutorial and in this tutorial I will show you a different type of map which is a Google map to display your statistic on the chart related to your business. So over here we have a chart which is a Google map chart and we are showing the sales values as the size of the circle and the profit is based on the color scheme. So that means darker the profit, darker brown is the profit, that means higher is the sales. So this is a very interesting and interactive chart where uh, you have a lot of options to zoom in and zoom out so if you click on zoom in you will be able to zoom in as it says and zoom out is uh, to zoom it out also you have the option of uh, dragging this pac-man onto the map to open the street view so if you want to have really something very detailed information that you are showing you can drag this person over here and this will show you the relevant location now to come back you have this arrow icon which you can come back uh, the third option which is very interesting over here is basically this icon which is the toggle full screen view and you will have a full screen let's say you have one centralized chart showing you the all the location of your sales then you can toggle into the full screen mode and all the different locations will be displayed for you to analyze your uh, data with the help of these uh, circles and the color coding so to come back you need to come over here and uh, the same chart will be displayed over here. So how we can create this type of a chart is again a very straightforward within the Google Data Studio without much of the hassle. So let me go into the edit mode and in the edit mode I will select this and uh, delete the chart. Add a chart like uh, for example Google Map over here and uh, drop it to the relevant location. Uh, you can drag it or down up or down based on your needs so that you can get the relevant screen size filled with the map afterwards you have to configure over here so by default the region field is being selected over here from here and uh, what you can do is uh, add the metric right now nothing is shown so what i will do is i will pick the sales and uh, put it for the bubble size so now the bubble size is relevant to the sales after that for bubble color what I need to do is bring the profit over here and put it over here so this way I can create my chart very easily with some dragging and dropping of the fields and it will be available for me into the front view, front end view for viewing and analyzing purposes